Well, good morning, guys. Must be game week. Back in the team room, so it feels official. We've got a game to play, right? Michigan State, here we go. Well, you know, I, I have an idea, but until you go play, you really don't know. Whether you're ready or not, we're going to kick the ball off at noon. They're doing a really good job. They've, they've worked really hard in their preparation. And uh, as we get into game week now, I mean, this is it. This is, this is why you coach. This is why you play. Whoever gives us the best chance to win, they're going to be on the depth chart. If it's a freshman, it's a freshman. And we've just tried to, you know, have as many opportunities for guys to show what they can do. When a guy makes plays, then you raise his level. And if he continues to make plays and do his job consistently, then he keeps climbing. Nobody around here gets any gifts. If you're on the depth chart in a one or two position, you've earned it. I feel good about where we are with the structure of our program. When you take over a program, uh, it's, it's about installing your culture and that culture is everything. It's the way we live our life. It's the collective way that we live as a team, as a program. Now, it doesn't mean that you take away individuality. You know, if you look at our guys, they all look different. They're from different areas. They sound different. But I think there's got to be commonality in your program that's your culture, that sets you apart from, say, another program. So we're developing our program in every area, whether it be in strength and conditioning, football, academics, uh, it doesn't matter. All those areas are being developed, um, and culturally, we're, we're, we like to think that we're vertically aligned and, and all doing it in the same direction. And that's that's what I feel best about. Now it's time to go put it out against somebody else and, and kind of see where we stand.